And if you're unable to make it in person, please visit us online at www.kennedy.com hyphen center.org where we make these performances available live every single evening and also in their archived format all right without any further ado won't you please join me in giving a very special welcome to hector del corto tango
Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you for being here tonight. Even though it's snowing, let us know, let us know. <laughs> um, we actually got here before the snow. We had just a little bit, but uh, thank you for your effort all the way getting here. Where did you leave your skis? <laughs> we just played, the first piece that we just played is from the new tango repertoire. And it's called Michelangelo 70, Michelangelo 70. And it was composed by this uh, big master of uh, tango music, which was Astro Piazzolla, that changed tango from the dance venues to the concert venues. Today you can hear his music all over the world in all the biggest stages, Kennedy Center. And um, so that's for the new tango. And the next, the, the following piece that we played is, was called Derecho Viejo, and it's from the traditional tango repertoire. Now we are going to play another piece that I have written in this paper. And the name of the piece is Canaro in Paris, also from the traditional tango repertoire. This is music that dancers love to uh, Is there any dancers here? Yes. Three. Well. There is carpet here, so don't hurt your knees.
Thank you. Thank you to the couple that was unseen. Thank you very much. And uh, if you notice this uh, last piece that we played is a different rhythm. And this is what we call milonga. Now, people know milonga as a rhythm. And also, these uh, dancers that were here know the milonga as the place where dancers gather to dance. And if you're interested in dancing tango, by the way, that's how I met my wife. Actually, I, she played with me, but then that's how we got together, was dancing tango. So if you want to get together with somebody, dance tango. If you want to divorce, dance with somebody else. <laughs> <laughs> but there are many, many places all over US, all over China, all over Japan, all over the world. Anywhere you go, in any town, there is a place where people gather to dance tango, believe it or not. You might think that I'm exaggerating. I tell you for sure you will find somebody dancing tango all over the world. Um, now we are going to play a different rhythm, which is played the milonga, which is a faster, they say happier rhythm. And uh, the, next <coughs> me. the next piece that we are going to play is what we call the vals, which is a waltz, Argentinian waltz. And uh, apparently, in uh, the beginnings of tango, people were not allowed to dance. The, the, uh, in the high society, they were not allow the girls to dance tango. So they came up with the idea of bringing the walls into the culture of tango. That way, they will get the high society girls to dance tango. And uh, so we had our own Argentinian walls. This is Palomita Blanca.
Thank you. The piece that we just played is a piece that I composed 20 years ago. 21, we are, we are in 2012. Or more than 21, I don't remember anymore. I was uh, two years and six months when I composed it. Well, how old do you think I am? <laughs> well, a little bit older. Anyway, um, I composed it because I was on tour with two amazing um, masters of tango. One was Astor Piazzolla, as I mention, mentioned before, and the other one was Osvaldo Pugliese. And yes, and we did the concert call finally together that you can find DVDs somewhere. It's been a long time, but they still sell them, I think. And uh, I composed this piece and I called it Los Magos, the Magicians. Um, now we are going to play from, from Astor Piazzolla, who, by the way, was a bandoneon player. Do you, do you know this instrument? Yes? All of you know this instrument? So if you know, tell me the name. Wow, that's amazing. Anyway, this, this instrument was, very quick, was created in Germany for religious purposes to, re to replace the organ in processions, so for religious purposes, and um, it didn't quite work well because it's a crazy system. So when you have something that uh, doesn't work quite well, a product, what do you do? Nobody's in business? Huh? To where? To Argentina, yes. So they did export it to Argentina. And of course, in Argentina, you know, we get the wrong things. And, uh, <laughs> and we learned it. But uh, so we are talking about Germany, religious purposes. It was on the way to Argentina and ended up in the Bordelos, <laughs> where tango began. So thanks to many, many great, amazing composers and, and orchestras, this instrument was moving again forward and forward until today is at the millen millennium stage. <laughs> so that's a quick story about the bandoneon. The next piece that we are going to play is from the master of uh, the bandoneon, Astor Piazzolla, and the name of the piece is Introduction to the Angel.
Jesu Ho Goncello.
Thank you very much. Let me introduce to you Alon Yavnai on piano. Pedro Giraud on double bass. Jisuo on cello. My name is Hector Del Curto and I play the bandoneon. Um, we are playing a lot of pieces from Astor Piazzolla and that uh, has a reason behind it. And the reason is that not only we are finishing our new CD that is dedicated to the music of Astor Piazzolla, but mainly because the past year, 2011, was his 90th birthday. It would have been his 90th birthday. birthday. And this year is 20 years of his uh, uh, death. So, excuse me? Yes. But um, we owe him all this amazing music, and this piece that we just played is called Adios Nonino, and he de dedicated this piece to the pass away of his uh, father. <coughs> so I said we are finishing our new CD. That doesn't mean that we don't have CDs here. <laughs> and we brought a lot of them because we didn't expect the snow to come. So you had to take 10 of them each. It's good because, you know, if you forgot for Christmas, you can give it to your friends, to your enemies. <laughs> so the CD is called Eternal Tango. Also, we have some CDs from Pedro's projects. He has a big band. So you can find them right behind the cameras in there. And uh, we are going to be signing them after this concert. So we are going to play now the last piece for tonight. And I, will, I want to thank everybody who made this possible to Kennedy Center Millennium Stage for bringing us here. And uh, thank you for coming here tonight. And uh, we are going to leave with a piece also by Astor Piazzolla and uh, trying to make it a little bit better out there. This is called Verano Porteño, summer from the port of Buenos Aires. <laughs> 